done when there's traffic out there. You know, we gotta we gotta put those numbers up. And, you know, we're not gonna do it all the time. It's gonna be a little more consistent than we've been. And um, you know, we also found some. We said, you know what, we're not gonna hit it at them. We're gonna hit over them tonight. <laughs> Yeah, the Cardinals will shake things up. Fowler leads off. Paul Goldschmidt hits second at first base. The young Ozuna Carpenter slides down to the five hole. Yadier Molina, Colton Wong, Harrison Bader, and the pitcher Miles Michaelis will make Fowler our American Eagle Credit Union player to bank on American Eagle Credit Union, your hometown home loan provider. First of three at 7.15 tonight. That means at 6.20, I will have Ameren total access. Then the first pitch, Michaelis and Fulton Evich Cardinals and Braves here at Bush Stadium. The Blues, well, they were back on the ice today at Enterprise Center before they get set to head to Boston tomorrow. will be media day on Sunday, and then game one on Monday night. Craig Berube on getting back on the ice and getting the team set to face the Bruins in the Stanley Cup Finals. They had a couple days off the ice, so we got to get out there and get moving again. And, and, you know, a lot of it's, you know, with the puck, get the puck moving again and touching it and get your feet moving again. You're, but I thought practice got better as it went along. It was, I thought it was a little bit slower early, but I picked up at the end, and, uh, you know, we finished off with some, you know, just some grinding down low stuff, which is always good. And then, uh, so... I thought it was good, though, overall. Ryan O'Reilly had a playoff career best three assists in the game six win. You leave it all out there. You know, it's everything you got. This is, there's nothing more to say before now. You know, it's one opportunity to win the cup, and, and it's taken one game at a time. It's crazy that, you know, it took 10 years to get to win a playoff series, and now we passed that and have a chance at this, the final. Win four more games and, 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 and be there. <laughs> it's incredible. So the Blues head to Boston tomorrow, media day Sunday, game one on Monday, and game two will be on Wednesday before the series heads back to St. Louis. A week from tomorrow will be game three at Enterprise Center. The latest, follow us Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. KMOX Sports at the ballpark. Getting ready for the Cardinals and Braves tonight. I'm Chris Raby at your home, the Cardinals and Blues, KMOX. Hey, St. Louis. Cardinals manager Mike Schilt here. Are you looking to upsize, downsize, first-time home buy? Make the smart move with my friends at American Eagle Credit Union. With American Eagle Credit Union, you'll save with great home loan rates, enjoy personalized, friendly service, and rest easy with local servicing after closing. American Eagle Credit Union is your hometown home loan provider. Stop by a branch near you or visit online at ameagleCU.org. Membership eligibility required. Loan subject to approval. Equal housing lender. NMLS 401252. Telling the story of family businesses, this week on the Business of Family Business, we'll be joined with Rick Nix Jr. from Butler's Pantry. If you were to tell your parents 20 years ago or 25 years ago that you were getting in the food service business, whether that's a restaurant job or a catering job, they probably would have thought of you as a failure. Rick tells his family story along with Dan Bean from CMA Consulting, who presents this program, The Business of Family Business. It's this Saturday starting at 3 on KMOX. If you're on Medicare and have a fixed income, there are benefit programs that can help you make ends meet. Find out if you're eligible for help with your Medicare premiums, electric bills, even groceries. Call Aid Smart Community Resources, your local area agency on aging, at 618-222-2561 to see if you qualify. It's free and confidential at 618-222-2561. Brought to you by the Aid Smart Community Resources and the National Council on Aging. Roger Brand in the Michaels Flooring Outlet.com Traffic Center. Well, busy on the highways, Mark. No surprise on the verge of a holiday weekend here. He's about 270. It's not that bad, but it is backed up approaching uh, McDonald Boulevard through the Interbelt New Floors and area northbound 67. Just some heavy pockets north of the Lewis Bridge up to the Clark Bridge. Nobody's going off to Grafton because everything's so flooded up there, so maybe that's helping just the regular commuters out. Uh, westbound 70 still kind of slow past the airport. There's a little backup, 94 Sunbelt. Some heavier traffic from 79, and that's sort of in pockets all the way out through Forestell now. Eastbound 70's jammed from west of Forestell up to Wentzel Parkway. Left lane blocked by an accident at 64 in St. Charles County. Still pretty solid, or at least slowed down from K out to Highway 70, but most of it's bumper to bumper. Southbound 141 at 64 in accident. Had traffic jammed back north of Ladue. Southbound 270 from Olive. Down to about Gravois, pretty heavy. South 170, Delmar to 64, you've got delays. Westbound 64, Kings Highway through McCausland. And I already mentioned St. Charles County. The eastbound 64 run through McKnight. Hanley is also backed up. Southbound 55, you've got an accident uh, in the right lane just before Rita's Barrick. So traffic's jammed back through Bayless. And then you have two accidents on southbound 55 right around Imperial. Left lane's blocked by the one I know. It's jammed back almost to Richardson Road. And then you're on the brakes again from M all the way down to Z. So pretty tough through there. Westbound 44, Hampton out to River to Pair, Lindbergh. 
through 141, there's a lot of uh, congestion, and it looks better out around 100 Washington. That earlier accident there looks like it's been cleared. Eastbound 64, Jefferson to the Poplar 70s, a little slow approaching Salisbury, and then once you get across to the Illinois side around Packers Avenue. Next update at 430 from the Michaels Flooring Outlet.com Traffic Center. Your forecast as you head into the weekend, I should also tell you, you need IT solutions. Visit our friends at Marco at MarcoNet.com for more information. Chance for rain both tomorrow and on Sunday, and hot and sticky upper 80s tomorrow, 86 on Sunday. I love movies. I love movies. Well, your movies bite the big one. Now, it's Mark on Movies on KMOX. All Hall from Common Guy Films here. We got a couple of movies to get to, so let's get right to it. Hey, can you make me a print? There is a lot of gray area in Make Me a Print. I can just make you a print. Oh, no. Right, you'd be...